the trail was not that bad, I think. It was pretty user friendly. And uh, there's a lot of fresh snow on the trail. Just kind of putting a cushion on the trail for the dogs and for the sleds. The, uh, you know, we got almost two feet of snow on Rainy Pass in the last couple days before the race. And so we went down the trail and you literally, if you looked at it uh, from the ground level, you wouldn't even see the dogs. They were b uh, below the, the snow level. So it was like having walls on each side. It made it a little difficult to pass teams. It made it difficult to stop and snack your dogs or change booties because, you know, with the field as tight as it is, someone always comes by within five minutes. So you end up making a little roadblock because there's really no way to get around. There's just basically one trail. Um, so that was a, a little bit of a challenge and it slowed the race down, but it really is, it makes it easy on the dogs. Their feet aren't taking the pounding. It's like a cushion on their feet. It's easy on the sleds. If you, if you do crash your sled, it's like, it's soft. So. No, I'd say the trail was probably better than I expected. Slower, but better.